Alright guys, so here we go dealing with a word problem dealing with both radical expressions and rational exponents. Okay, so this is a word problem. Let's go ahead and read it and then we'll talk about how we're going to set this up to solve. It says, to find the distance a fret should be placed from the bridge, multiply the length of the string by, and they give you the following, 2 to the negative n over 12. Okay, so we're talking about a guitar here. Alright, and the bridge, okay, is going to be this part right here on the guitar, okay? And we can see that the length of our string from the bridge, right, to our neck, going all the way up, is going to be 54, all right? And we can say that that will be 54 centimeters, or, yeah, we'll say 54 centimeters, okay? So we'll say that it's 54 centimeters. So what they want us to figure out is where should this third fret be placed, all right? So again, they give us this value right here and they tell us, okay, to multiply the length of the string by this number to figure out where the third fret should be. Now this n, okay, is going to be where you put in your third fret or three, okay? So again, we're just going to set this up and then we're going to solve, all right? So let's go ahead and do this. So we need to multiply the string length by this. So let's go ahead and do that. So our string length, which we said is going to be 54. So we'll have the following here. We'll have 54 times, and then we'll have 2. And remember, we're trying to determine where the third fret should be placed. So we're going to plug a 3 in to here. This will all be over 12. Okay, so we'll have 54. And then we know that negative 3 divided by 12 is going to be, well, that will be the following. We'll have 2 and then negative 1 over 4, right? Well, let's think of now how we can go about rearranging this. Remember your properties of um, exponents here. We have a negative. So if we bring it down the, to the denominator, right, we need to make it positive. So we'll have the following. We'll have 54 over, and we're going to bring this whole thing down. 2, but since we brought it down, again, the exponent becomes positive. Now, again, this is going back to your properties of exponents. Okay. And then we can write this as the fourth root. So we'll have the following. So we'll have 54 all over the fourth root. So, and now what we're going to do here is we're going to plug this into our calculator. Okay. And we're going to figure out what we get here. So... We're going to do 54 divided by the fourth root of 2. So let's go ahead and do this. <clears throat> so 54 divided by the fourth root of 2. And we get 45.4, and we'll say 45.41. So we get 45.41, and this will be in centimeters. Okay. And that's going to be your final answer. So that is the distance, okay? The third fret needs to be going from the bridge and up the neck. All right, so you would suspect that it would put you um, somewhere around here, right? Is where the third fret would probably be, right? This would be your distance of um, 45.41, okay? And that's that.